folks how we doing and in today's video we're gonna take a look at the duality base studio from audio assault so I'm just gonna go through a few of the presets not all we'll just say one or two from each section and uh, I'm one that I've actually made myself so start off with clean one Destruction 2 This is metal string. He's steel too. myself and uh, just call this Lee Metal. <laughs> Pretty gnarly on this one.
Right, let's dive down and have a look at the user interface. This is the uh, the user interface, pretty straightforward. So you've got your, your amp section here, it's a three channel amp, power on and off, you've got gain, three band EQ, presence and a master, and then you've got a uh, little crunch, uh, sub knob and then a mix knob. 99% is fully from the amp same, and then for the round to zero is blending it with uh, the DI. And then you've got a whole host of presets in there. Cleans, destruction, metal. I've even done my own little preset. Yep, you can save your own presets in here. Rock, so you've got punky ones, and then you've got some basic rock ones and then some thrash ones and then in front of that oops, just turn that off. in front of that you've got your bass drive right, same again there you've got a whole host of uh, different options right, from a British stack, American stack, metal stack American console, British console, digital distortion, low watt head, um, overdrive pedal, distortion pedal or fuzz and then you've got high and low pass filters uh, before and after the drive and uh, you can either have this pre the uh, the amp or post the amp so you've got good options and same again this is the mix of the actual distortion itself oh well I did forget to mention um, there is a gating with this as well and then you've got your cab section and you've got a good selection of cabs in there Trace Elliott, Zealers, BVs, uh, DG, not sure what they are, Ampeg, Ashfields so you've got, got a good selection there and you can have two cabs and then at the bottom here you can blend those cabs together either have it bang in the middle uh, either one or the other and you can have a, a mix anywhere in the middle of the two and then right at the end you've got this effect selection so you can have up to four different effects in there and just right click you can either have an EQ Exciter plugin from Audio Assault, pretty cool. Uh, compressor, delay, chorus, and reverb. And the good thing about this, you put your exciter in, put the chorus in, and a bit of compression. The thing is, if you're not happy with it, you can just swap them about. And if you want to add an EQ in there as well, say, so just move them about as you wish which is pretty cool so let's see how this sounds in the mix
So there you've heard it, the uh, the base duality, no, sorry, the duality base studio from Audio Assault. So you've heard some examples there, uh, both on its own and in the mix. Uh, what I will say, when I first got it, it was like, yeah, yeah, it's all right. But after doing a bit of messing about with it over the last couple of days, I'm actually quite liking it now. Uh, I'm going to do some more messing about with it and uh, get some more of my own presets, perhaps my own clean tone and perhaps another one or two distorted gnarly type tones. But overall, I, I, I think decent little bass amp so, you know, You've got plenty of options in there. With that little distortion thing, you can either have it pre or post. The amp, loads of different caps to choose from. What I did forget to mention is you can actually load up your own IRs in there as well. So if you've got your own bass IRs, you can bang them in. And that effect section at the back is pretty cool. So you can add EQs, compression, uh, choruses, delays, exciters, and then just place them as you want. So you've, you've got a absolute ton of options in there. But anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. I'll put a link to the Audio Assault website so you can get this from down in the video description. And if you made it to this far, well done. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. And if you did like it, uh, please share it with your friends and consider subscribing. And that's all for this video. And I'll catch you in the next one. Hello right, folks, I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, you can follow me on social media and uh, you can also now get my music online. All links will be in the video description and uh, you can click up here to uh, subscribe. I'll click the link down there for more videos that you may not see. Keep it loud and keep it heavy.